There's a program geared toward making sure that children in the court system get the justice they deserve and they don't fall through the cracks. WBRE 28, WIOU 22. Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Allen talked with members and volunteers about the program and how you can get involved. Court appointed special advocates is what CASA stands for. Began with a judge in the state of Washington who felt that he was making two important decisions in the lives of abused and neglected children with insufficient information. Many children going through the court system struggle to have their voices heard. The Susquehanna Valley CASA program is a way for them to get more individual support. Case manager Louise Campana knows the issue better than most. She's a former volunteer with CASA and retired teacher and says she's always been passionate about helping children. I mean, there are kids in my classroom who I knew they were being were not being taken care of, were, were being abused and neglected. But I had no proof, I had no avenue. CASA now gives me an avenue. CASAs are volunteers that go through 30 hours of training before they're assigned a case with a child or children. We will talk to them about the cases and we'll assign together. Um, and they get appointed by the courts. From there, the volunteer works with the child through the entire case. They spend time together and ensure their voices are heard in court. I'm the one who has the time to do that. The other services that are involved have big caseloads and are spread kind of thin. So I'm going to pay attention to that child. Volunteer Nancy Penfield says it's hard to work with children that have faced so much trauma, but watching their growth makes it all worth it. When I started to see a light shining in there, in the child, that maybe they were working their way through and were going to get out the other side of the darkness that they're in. CASA says they've had an increase in cases since the pandemic started and are always in need of more volunteers. To learn more, head over to pahomepage.com. In Williamsport, Jasmine Allen, 2822 Eyewitness News.